Hey everybody, it's Sheila and I have a share for you today. Um, I'm nervous and excited about this. This is a handmade postcard that I made for Laura, who is Teal Blue Crafter, um, here on YouTube. She um, was my partner for a handmade um, postcard swap that Heather, whose idea is to come, hosted. And what we had to do was we had to make a postcard that was um, in the theme or colors or something that our partner liked. And so uh, my inbox back and forth with Laura, uh, who is super sweet, by the way, just a very, very, very nice uh, lady. And um, I found out that she likes the kind of old school romance, vintage, uh, the softer colors, you know, like the beiges and soft browns and pinks and creams and whites and all that. So um, I have to admit, I was a little nervous in making this um, because... I don't generally work with lighter colors like that. I, do, I mean, I do like pinks and I've used pinks and stuff, but um, knowing that I'm making it for somebody else because it's what they like is kind of nerve-wracking. <laughs> but here's what I did. So I'm going to um, show you what I did. Um, the background paper here is from a very, very old paper stack. Seriously, you guys. Um, probably you people who do layouts and have been doing scrapbook for a while, scrapbooking for a while and layouts will probably have heard of it, but it's called Heritage Papers. Um, and I think it was called Paper Pizzazz. Um, I don't even know if they're still around. I, I cannot even tell you how long I've had those paper stacks. At least 10 years, if not longer. But that was the background. It's this sort of beigey color poking through there. Um, this picture I got from the Fashionista collection from uh, Graphic 45. Which I, I love this because, you know, it's that old school that I hope she likes. And I love how she's looking at him. And he has that little grin smile. It's just awesome. I just, it's so romantic and they look so happy. <laughs> but I matted that on a piece of pe pink paper um, that you can just barely see. It only sticks up here at the uh, top. Okay, so let me take you around the card. Um, here on the side, these are the little mini roses and they were white. Pink and white I had. And then these ones that are the sort of the beigey color, I had to paint them. But I think they turned out really well. Um, so I, you know, like I said, I put those here along the edge. Down here on the bottom, I put this really pretty um, pink lace ribbon that you can see peeking out all along the edge. Um, this heart was a cardboard or cardstock heart, and I painted it uh, sort of a beige color. And I had this little wooden sentiment that I got in the rack from Jill, and I glued that onto there. And I just think that looks so, I love it. It's so cute. I think it just goes with the overall theme of the uh, postcard that I was making. Um, also along here at the top, you can only really see it here, but I put two rows of this, uh, pinkish iridescent, um, pearl trim, uh, that I thought, thought I, bleh, thought looked really cute. I can't talk, apparently. And next I came in here and added this little pink butterfly. Again, I painted that because it was sort of a greenish, yellowy, really yucky color. <laughs> and I added in a little bit of that pearl trim there as well. Uh, this paper flower came from Prima. I added a button on it. This little, um, these little sprays of ribbon sticking out here, they're cream colored. Um, I made that when I was just messing around with ribbon, like, I don't know, a month ago, and it sort of looked like a little fan, so I just stuck it behind there because I thought it looked really nice. Um, added some more flowers here and a little acrylic heart back there. Um, up here, this, um, flower came from Walmart. Um, it was a really big flower. I took it apart and added this smaller pink flower in the middle with a little pink um flat back pearl in the middle um this tag here i've had forever but it went perfect with this postcard um it says you and me and i just love it i just love 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 it and it looks so well the colors and everything went with it the sentiment the last thing i did was um i added these uh sort of a beigey brown flat back pearls at the top um i really like it you guys i'm, I'm just not even gonna lie to you <laughs> But I don't know if Laura will like it. I really hope she does. I gotta say, this was fun. And um, this only took me about two days to make. Um, but lots of hours. Because I was pulling things out and trying them. But um, I hope you like it, Laura. Um, Heather, thanks for hosting. I'm going to make another video and show you uh, the other thing, uh, other thing I made for her. <laughs> because uh, we had to make something else handmade for them. So, hope you like the postcard, Laura. Thanks for watching, guys. I will see you around. Bye!